guys, it's Delcy and welcome back to my channel. So, today's video is going to be um, all of the makeup products that I use, like my makeup brushes and all of my skincare products. Um, so, I hope you guys enjoy this video. So, the first thing I'm going to talk about is my skincare products. Like, I have some face masks and stuff here that I have. So, the first mask thing that I have is the one for, like, my hair. So, it's this Garnier Fructis, Fructis Sleek Shot and Shower Styler. And it just looks like this. And then I have this Ultra Hydrating Moisturizing Sleeping Mask, which I don't think I'll ever use it like when I sleep. I think I'll just use it because, I don't know. And then I have this Freeman Hydrating um, Mask, and it looks like this. It's a gel one. Then I have two of these spa treatment masks, and this is what they look like. I have a nose strip, and then I have two face strips, which I think they're the same. Like these ones you put like on your chin and on your forehead, so I'm going to have to try those out because I've never used them before. So now on to like skincare, skincare. So I use this on the spot acne treatment from Neutrogena. I'm not sure where I got this. Um, I think you can get, like, get them from, like, any, like, drug store or, like, gas station kind of thing or Walmart or Target and stuff like that, um, or CVS or something. Um, but I usually just put it on when I see, like, I have, like, small pimples forming or, like, I can see, like, them start to form. I put this on. And then I have this Mary Kay Naturally Exfoliating Powder. And I also have a, this is like a face wash. I have another face wash that's the Mary Kay Naturally brand and it's the ex polishing. It's, I don't remember what like it's actually called, but it's like the face wash. And then I have this moisturizing stick from Mary Kay Naturally and it looks like this on the inside. So you just kind of like twist it up and I use it like after I shower and wash my face because my skin gets like really dry. And I have this nourishing oil from the same brand, it's the other two things, and it's got like this little tube kind of thing, and you just put a few drops in your hand and I put it all over my face. Sometimes I use it, I haven't used it recently, um, but I use the uh, nourishing thing, like the nourishing, like the face wash of this brand, and I use this um, almost every day. So now I'm going to go on to my makeup. Um, so first I'm going to just talk about, I'm just going to do the makeup brushes that I like don't always use. Um, and like what I would use them for if I ever use them. I don't use them every time I use, I do my makeup. So I have this sponge and I got it from Target. No. Walmart and um, I usually use it I sometimes I use it for like my foundation um, then I have these four not four five small makeup brushes I think I got them for like a gift um, these I think I use them really all for eyeshadow and like different like things of eyeshadow like this one I put on I use it to go on like these two I use to put eyeshadow on these two I use to like um either blend or like I use this one to blend my eyeshadow and I use this one to like put eyeshadow like in my creases and this one I use to put eyeshadow like in the corner like corners of my eyes um then I have this one that kind of, that matches the, like, 
I think I also got it as a gift and sometimes I use it for foundation. I have this one. It's from e.l.f. And I usually, if I use it, I use it for blush. Then there's this one. is also from e.l.f. And I think I also use this one for foundation or a concealer. And then these two are from the same brand. It's Eco Tools, and you'll see how you, I use Eco Tool brushes. Um, this one I usually use for, I sometimes use for like my eyebrows. And this one I would use for like highlight, like putting on highlight and stuff. But they're in this mason jar because I barely, like I don't really use them a whole lot. So I just keep them in here. <clears throat> so going on, just going on the trend of makeup brushes, um, I have... Well, I have these four makeup brushes that I use every time I do my makeup. And I, the first thing I, I have is tweezers for my eyebrows. And then I have this one, and it also came in a set with those other ones that were like this. And I use this for powder. Um, I have this beauty blender from Walmart, um, and I use it for my concealer and foundation. <coughs> These three are all from the same brand, Eco Tools, and I got them from Walmart. And this one I use for my highlight. Um, and these two I use for my eyeshadow. I use this one uh, to apply, like all the different shades, and I use this one to blend and then add shades as I need. So now into like the actual makeup. Um, like. I guess I would do it, I guess I'll go through them like in the order that I like put them on. So I'm just trying to get myself all situated here based on like how I usually do my makeup. So the first thing I do is I use primer and this is the e.l.f. blemish control face primer and it's from Walmart. And then, ooh, and then I use this concealer and it's from cover it's the cover girl true blend it's lit and i don't know the shade but it's like it's light and it's almost gone so i'll need to get a new one eventually but it's not the time um and then i use cover girl clean liquid foundation and it's the excuse me it's the buff beige shade so it's nothing like similar to this one like it, they're my concealer is a lot lighter than my foundation, and I I don't always use foundation, but if I do use it, and I'm not like going to an event, I usually just put it under my eyes, like where I put my concealer. And then I use the Airspun Loose Face Powder. I also got it from Walmart. Um, I don't know the shade. I don't think it's like a specific shade. I don't think this one has specific shades. Um, and then usually I will do my eyeshadow. And I use this CoverGirl eyeshadow. I think it's from Walmart as well. And it's got like a pink shade, a brown, like a light pink nude shade, a brown shade, a glittery purple shade. And then there's like a shade missing, but I that's because like I broke, I think I dropped the palette and it broke. So I have three shades left and I usually just use like the light pink and the dark and the, br like the brown color, I guess you can call it. So then like depending on my mood, I'll either do my highlight or my eyebrows next. So this is the highlight I use and it's, for, it's by, it's an e.l.f. brand and it's from Walmart. And it's the glow shade. And then for eyebrows, it really just depends on my mood. Uh, really, so I have this elf pen and brush combined thing. So I obviously use it for the every time I do my makeup for the brush. Um, it's elf. It's from Walmart. It's I don't know what this shade is. The shade is autumn in this one. Um, so I usually use this most of the time. Um, 
I also have this e.l.f. one, and this is the light thing, like a light shade, and it's from Walmart, I believe, and it has like a dark and a light brown. I think this dark one is like the same, is a little bit darker, the same shade as like my pen. Um, and sometimes like I'll use like this, and I'll use like that, um, I'm trying to figure it out. Um, usually if I use this, I'll use this brush to like apply it. Um, I sometimes use this like in my daily like one I'll like if I for makeup I usually will I'll either pick one or the other or I'll like combine them a little bit. So then the last thing I usually do is my mascara. So I have this um, this curl eyelash curler and I got it off of Wish. It came with a bunch of three. There's this one. There's, I have a pink one and a green one. And I use this one all the time. And then this is the mascara I have. It's Maybelline. It's the Great Lash one. And it's from Walmart. So all of my products are from Walmart. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys in my next video.